Hi, this is Amy, and today we're going to learn how to use the chat feature in your Gmail account. So you see your, your little chat widget down below your labels in your Gmail account over on the left-hand side. The first thing we're going to do is move that chat widget up to the right. If you're really going to use it and make it a part of how you work, this is going to make it a lot easier to see when something's going on and to activate it. So the first thing we're going to do is click the gear in the top right and go to settings. And now we'll click labs up at the top. We're looking for a lab called right side chat. So if you type in the word right into the search box, you'll see it show up under available labs, right side chat. So we'll go ahead and enable that and then save this at the bottom. That's going to refresh our mailbox and move our chat widget up and to the right. So you can see my widget up here and to the right, and I've actually started a conversation with Jamie Jackson, who's a teacher at Village Middle School, and she has a student on her side named Armand, who is going to chat with me this morning. So here they are, and we're going to chat. I am going to show you, first of all, though, how to find someone in chat. So I'd already had a chat with Jamie before she shows up in my list, but if I hadn't, then I can just search for her. I hover over her name, or actually I'm going to click her name, and the chat pops up. Sometimes I have to click on the little chat box like that, and remember I should be saying Hangouts, not chat, because now it's all called Hangouts. So let me ask Armand how he's doing today. And we'll see what he says when he writes me back. We'll see it right in this little pop-up window. And this is the latest version of Google Hangouts, and it's a, a really convenient little tool. So anytime I have something to say that's just a sentence or I need an answer right now, I'm at work, I find out whether my colleagues are online, and they're shown to me with a little green dot. So you can see how when I look at Jamie, I see this green dot right here. I know she's online. Uh, that could be on her phone, though, so I don't always know she's at her desk. So let me answer Armand. You see how while he's thinking, I see some little green dots pop up, and I think he's uh, with his whole class right now, so they're probably discussing what they're going to say back to us. When he starts to type or clicks in the box, it's going to show us that he's thinking about what to say. So he says sometimes he does use this chat thing. He talks to his friends, and he plays with the video chat thing too. All right, well, let's thank him for his time today, and then we'll move on to looking at a little more. Oh, not when teachers are teaching. Miss Jackson told me to say that. That's great, Armand. <laughs> Thanks for adding that in. All right, so I just finished up my conversation with Armand, and I'm going to close out this widget. That's just going to close this chat, but anytime I want to open it back up again, I can easily do that. So I can go back and look at chats I've had with previous people. Um, let me check out this one I had with Kelly earlier. Uh, there it is, and we can start up a chat again right here, no problem. So it's a really nice little feature. So let's say I want to chat with my colleague, um, my colleague Barbara Estep. So I'm going to start typing in her name. She's my work colleague, and I'm in my work account, so I see her pop up here. And I can click the little Hangouts button right here to start a chat with Barbara. Now, it's going to tell me if she's not at her computer right now or doesn't have a way to get this message, but it looks like maybe she is. It doesn't say she's online, though. So I can try contacting her here, and uh, she will probably see that when she sits back down at her computer. So that's how to add someone when you don't see them there already. So I want to show you one more feature of Hangouts before we break today, and that's the ability to do a video Hangout. So there's really nothing to it. It's very simple. All you have to do once you get a chat started is just click this little camera right here. So this starts a video call, and um, if I called right now, Ms. Jackson's class would be able to answer, and we could talk together through Hangouts. So this is really great if you have to have a meeting and you're in two different locations. Um, you can see each other right here. You just have to make sure both sides have a microphone and a camera. So thanks for watching this video today about how to chat using Hangouts in your Gmail account. I hope you will try this out today. And uh, if you want, you can start a chat with me. I'd love to hear from you. Thanks and bye-bye.